members of the International Brotherhood of Electrical Workers and the National Electrical Contractors Association join together to create industry-leading standards for training. Graduates earn the pay and benefits that you'd expect from this level of professionalism. Apprenticeship is the gateway to an exciting career on the cutting edge of the electrical industry. You do learn something every day. For me, I like to be outside and work with other people and stuff, so it's really good to get that type of atmosphere. I like being on a construction site where there's so many things going on. One day you're maybe running a shovel, the next day you're pulling wire, the next day you're hooking up a transformer. It's always something different, and it's not just hooking wires up to make it run. There's a lot of craftsmanship to it. Apprentices work with experienced electricians on job sites to earn while they learn. Over the course of the five-year training, an apprentice can make over $155,000 in wages while in the program. Even now I'm making a wage that I can live on and support a family. It's already paid off for me and I'm not even done yet. The Twin Cities Joint Apprenticeship and Training Committees of NECA and the IBEW is a model education partnership producing the best trained, most up-to-date electrical apprentices and journeymen in the country. Training is a top NECA and IBEW priority, and Twin Cities area JATCs commit over three and a half million dollars per year to this education. The results? a knowledgeable and reliable workforce whose members keep pace with rapid changes in technology. The partnership between labor and management ensures that classes prepare apprentices for the jobs that employers really need and meet the exacting standards they expect. The employers are half of the JETC and so they, are, they definitely have an input and they're the ones that hire our apprentices. And, and we have approximately 140 employers that come to us. The St. Paul Electrical Training Center, located in the southeast corner of the city, is a state-of-the-art facility that prepares apprentice and journeyman electricians and communication technicians for every facet of their ever-changing and expanding industry. It's an up-to-date facility, you know, with stuff that you really do out in the field. This place is uh, equipped with everything that you would possibly need for the future. And they try to stay ahead with uh, all the technologies. Students get hands-on experience, from basic skills like pipe bending and wiring to the growing fields of programmable logic controllers and solar energy. Manufacturers supply the training center with the latest equipment and supplies, sometimes before they reach the general market to assure the next generation of electricians are on top of the latest innovations. We have a solar furnace on the building. It was the first one installed in the cities. First class facilities are great, but the instructors are at the core of this education. With years of experience and specialized training themselves, they know the field and they know how to communicate with their students. The instructors, they really know what they're talking about and they know They've, they've worked as electricians out in the field and they understand what we go through at work. They've actually done it and they're very willing to help you learn. They want you to succeed. What I really like about teaching is, is first of all, being with the students. That's very gratifying. For me, that's, there's nothing better than thinking that I, I made a difference to a young person's life in terms of giving them a career. Classes aren't just about future jobs. They apply immediately to the work site. People are asking questions about, hey, I had this issue at work or we're working on this and instructors will tell them their experience and what they've seen in their past. It seems like most of them worked in the field for 20 years or more. It cuts down the amount of questions that you have to go back and ask. It makes your job run a lot smoother. You know, you aren't constantly asking what do I do next. We always have a real world application in our labs no matter, there's always one thing that we do and plus our teacher knows that we don't want to be sitting on our butts all the whole time. So he gets us up, gets us moving around, sees something, you know, real world application. A true electrician is an individual who can wire a house but understands how the house works too as well. That's an electrician. I teach people to be electricians. Or you can show me on the job, this is what you do, you know? This is how you install this, but I want to know why it's doing that. I want to know why it's working like that. 
by learning the actual theory and the workings of, of electricity, I'm better able to understand it on the job. And I'm also able to be a much safer worker. Students learn to work at the safest possible level. The OSHA training and certification they receive through the program is a requirement for many jobs. Renewable energy technologies require a certified electrician to install and maintain these systems. The St. Paul Training Center offers classes in the latest solar and wind power practices. Students help the environment and themselves by preparing for this high demand sector. Employers are updating themselves as well with the technology and the solar and the wind, so they're looking for people that are educated in those situations. They're looking for a certificate of knowledge, which you get if you take the solar classes here. So they're coming away with a new mindset that they can bring to a potential employer or their current employer in terms of how to implement these new green technologies that implement what we call the triple bottom line that will improve profit, planet, and the people. We do make a difference with the green training and, and the alternative energy, the wind. A lot of our members have worked on big wind projects around the Midwest. The Twin Stadium was a lead stadium, okay, and, and the, the workers that were there had to be trained in green technology in order to work there. So we know that that kind of work is coming down the line. So the students that are taking advantage of this are going to be up there in the front. The power from the sun and wind is not just for classes. The solar panels on the roof and near the building help power the facility. A monitor displays and tracks the energy and cost savings generated on site. Other classes prepare apprentices to program computers to run motors, even factories. The basic apprenticeship program is five years, the equivalent of a college degree, but without the burden of thousands of dollars in tuition costs or loans to repay when you're done. The tuition is covered by being a part of the IBEW NECA team. I'm not tens of thousands of dollars going into debt doing this. This is a great deal. Apprenticeship is just the beginning of your education. Journeymen continue to keep up with an ever-changing field. They can take courses to keep their skills and license current or to prepare for new jobs, like working with high voltage power. It's continuing education to keep your license valid and it's all offered here that you can take the classes. There's multiple courses that you can sign up for to always better yourself and have other licenses. Be informed on what's new and what can be able to keep you more productive and knowledgeable. That will ultimately keep you working. JATC training and IBW membership provide opportunities to work on a wide variety of jobs across the country. There's the IBEW just in about any, any, you know, every state in the U.S. So it would be awesome to travel to different places and work there for a year or six months and get to know the place. The IBEW accommodates the needs and schedules of active service members so their union benefits and their education aren't disrupted. There's times when I have to leave for either a military school or our annual training and when you come back the teachers will get you up to speed what you missed. I went on a year deployment, came back and basically started off right where I left off. So you don't really miss out on anything. The Joint IBEW and NECA Training Center gives you the tools to go as far as you want to go in the electrical field. You learn everything here, basically. I mean, and whatever stuff that might come up in the future, I'm sure they'll, they'll up their facility to, to be able to accommodate for that. It's not easy, but it's rewarding after you do it and go through it. I mean, every year is different and you learn so much and you're so much more well-rounded. I like to be able to see everything come together and you kind of get a, a sense of accomplishment and pride in what you're, what you're building. When you hear something on the job that you were taught in school, all of a sudden your brain goes, oh, wait a minute, we've been, we've been shown this or we've been taught this, so, you know, go out and, you know, let's, let's make it happen. If you would like to be the best in the electrical field, the St. Paul JATC would love to hear from you. Please give us a call at 651-772-8746 or check out our website, www.ibew110.org 
slash J-A-T-C.